Guess what? We're on another photography vlog. Because we're on a photography vlog, you have to dress like a photographer. Let's go ahead and do a little photographer fit check. So, I mean, for starters, we've got the bag, satchel, not a purse, only hope supply, styler, get nerdy, jeans, dark denim, because obviously you don't look artsy if you're not wearing jeans while you're doing something, and then boots, staple of photographers. You're not a photographer if you don't wear these things. So what we're gonna be photographing today is actually the vintage collection and not the Black Series or uh, Lego minifigures. And the reason for that is I think I'm becoming a vintage collection collector. There's a video that's gonna be coming out as a Patreon exclusive pretty soon about why I stopped collecting the Black Series. Uh, for the most part, I mean, there's still gonna be some figures that I'm gonna buy. But as a whole, I think the vintage collection is in a better direction. So if you wanna know why I stopped collecting them, Go ahead and support me on Patreon. There's a link in the description. But today we're gonna to be shooting uh, vintage collection stuff. So it's exciting. Never covered it on the channel before. I don't even think I've done it before, like even off camera. So we're breaking new ground today, folks. It's been a really long time since I've been out here. I think the last time I was out here was a video with, uh, yeah, with my friend whose name is actually Cal. And we shot his um, cosplay photography. There'll be a little card popping up right here, but yeah, that was a fun little adventure. I kind of forgot about that, to be honest with you. So I think we've come up on our first spot here. Uh, as you can see, the tower's in the background. Um, I don't think I'm gonna try to get that in the shot, but I found this nice little rock here, right there. And it's got all these tall, kind of like growth around it. And then I can maybe position it where the sun's like peering through the grass. I think that could look really cool with some clone troopers. And I also brought uh, this new Obi-Wan figure from the Vintage Collection. That is him, uh, excuse me, frog in my throat. That is him from the uh, first three episodes where he's like the wandering Jedi. And I thought this location would look a lot like Mapuzo. And so I was like, oh, okay, I'll bring him in, you know, try to get some shots with that. So I think he might be the key to some good photos tonight. I'm already getting eaten alive. You can probably see some of the bugs flying around my face right now. It's very hot. It's the downside of wearing a photography get up with the jeans and the boots. It makes you sweaty, but you look epic. So take my advice, do it. We got Obi-Wan here posed up on this rock. And he's got his lightsaber hilt. And I think we got some really cool shots with that. I, it looks like some scenes from the show. And uh, yeah, I'm excited about him, so. Can't wait to get back and edit those bad boys up. Now I think I found the spot for the clone troopers and you might recognize, we actually used this, me and Cal did in that one vlog last time we came out here. And uh, this is where we shot him kneeling with the rocks circled around him, um, which was really cool. I don't know, it's just cool to be back here and using it for a completely different purpose and scene really. So we're gonna put some clone troopers around here. I don't have a way of holding these blasters, so they're going in my mouth. Whew, okay. We made it to the top. It's freaking beautiful up here. I yelled off of this tower in my last video when we were out here. Oh, I'm so out of breath from those stairs. That is a sign of weakness. I yelled off of this tower in my last video out here. And so of course we're gonna have to yell something this time as well. And we're also like shooting clone troopers. So that really only leaves me with one option. For the Republic! That was really loud considering just sprinting back to the truck so I don't get eaten alive by bugs this entire time. It's been kinda sorta brutal. Like, look at that thing. My big bulging bicep. You see that big bug bite? So because I'm not the biggest fan of grainy footage, I'm not gonna wait till I get all the way back to my truck to record the outro. So I'm just gonna say good night here. Thank you so much for watching and uh, may the force be with you, always. Bye.